in battle liquor tycoon Y.J. Malia will return to Westminster Magistrates Court in London today for closing arguments in his extradition trial and for the judge to set a timeline for a ruling in the high-profile case. The 62-year-old former Kingfisher Airlines boss, who has been on bail on an extradition warrant since his arrest in April last year, is fighting extradition to India on charges of fraud and money laundering amounting to around Rs 9,000 crores. The senior district judge will hear final submissions. Judgment will be reserved until a future date, to be arranged, said a spokesperson for the Crown Prosecution Service, which is representing the Indian authorities in the case. At the last hearing in the case on April 27, the Central Bureau of Investigation, CBI, had received a boost in the case as Judge Arbuthnet confirmed that the bulk of the evidence submitted by the Indian authorities will be admissible in the case. The CBI had submitted a detailed set of documents to the UK court, which includes its case of conspiracy against former Adbi Bank Deputy Managing Director B.K. Batra, who was referred to in court as a new villain of sorts in the case. As per the Indian authorities' case of conspiracy, Batra reportedly colluded with Malia in sanctioning some of the loans to the now-defunct Kingfisher Airlines without following due diligence procedures. Malia's defense team, headed by barrister Claire Montgomery, has disputed the fraud allegations and also submitted further written material from UK-based prisons expert Dr. Alan Mitchell, challenging some of the photographs of Barrack 12 of Mumbai Central Prison on Arthur Road where Malia is to be held if he is extradited from the UK.